Welcome back to my channel everyone. This is Donnie and you're watching Diamond Painting by Donnie. Today I have a little bit of an unboxing and, and then I'm going to show you how to use the item that's in here. Uh, first of all, I'd like to say that this was not something I discovered on my own. Uh, one of my viewers um, had told me to go check out another person's channel that's fairly new and um, they were using this item and thought I would be something I would be interested in. And so what I'm going to do is link the video where I found um, where I was sent to, to that I did discover this. And in fact, I did enjoy what I saw. So I thought I would get it myself and try it out. So I will link her channel up here. Her channel name is called Diamond in the Rough. And I believe she's Australian. So that's where I found this. So now I'm going to show you what it is. I haven't opened it yet, but it came on Sunday. Today is Monday. So I got it yesterday and I've been um, excited to give it a shot, but I had to make pens all day yesterday. So I couldn't do it. There we go. Okay. So it's pretty small and here it is it's called the Zyron sticker maker it was ten dollars on Amazon when I bought it and let me check real quick to see if it's still that price yeah I've ordered quite a bit of stuff since then yeah it was $9.99 as of me ordering it. Oh, it's actually down to $9.49 now. Wow. So I missed out on a 50 cent savings, <laughs> but that's fine. Um, let's open it up and show you how it works. I'm going to try things out exactly the way she showed because it seems to be, seemed to be a quite a nice, um, way of doing things. Uh, actually here, let's look at this. It's got, um, it does say that there's refill cartridges available. They have permanent adhesive and, um, repositionable adhesive available. And this shows you the directions, how to do it. It is acid free, non-toxic and Perfect for ribbon, letters, and buttons, small paper shapes, small embellishments. And you can make stickers up to one and a half inches wide, which I'm hoping, because I have something set. Okay, that's just almost exactly one and a half inches. Okay, so suitable for ages five and older. The unit contains functional sharp edge and points. All right, so. It's got 20 feet of sticker permanent adhesive in this box. It's got the red, the pink label. So that shows you that that's the permanent. They also have refills. I haven't ordered the refills yet until I actually try this out, but I have it in my cart. So this is all it contain. All it consists of is this big X and there's your adhesive down below on the roll. And here's where it comes out. And there's your sharp edge, which is plastic, but still sharp. And so she uses it for labels on her, her diamond painting kits. And I'm going to kit up a small kit. It's got 10 colors. It's for a rhinestone diamond painting with special shapes that, uh, I haven't shown yet, but I have done my unboxing of it and it requires a ruler and here is my labels that I want to make and here is the kit. I'm going to use this kit with the, oh boy, that's not going to fit. Um, I guess I'll put them on the side because I wanted to use these. These are the ones I just purchased and I wanted to try them out. They're the ones with the single boxes. 
So I think what I'll do is when I put the label on, I will do it on the corner and wrap it around the side so that, you know, it'll show on both sides. Or I could just put it on there and, you know, fold it over the edges because that won't matter. Actually, let me just trim it. I can trim it a bit so that it won't uh, be too big for my containers. I'll trim a little bit off of each side. Because I don't need all that white extra. Alright, so let's see if that'll fit on here. Yeah, that should fit perfect. Alright, so we've got that. And I only have 10 colors, but some of them have more than one package, so. Um, firstly, she said, what she does is, um, like I used to just take a, uh, take my canvas and I would put it on the copy machine and then I could change the, I could crop it from there. It's really delicate though, because the screen on my printer is like this big and trying to pinch and squeeze on that was just a pain but she did mention how she just takes a photo with her camera with her phone and then prints it from there and that's what I did and it was fairly large because this was a very small um key so they printed out pretty big which is nice I like them printed out nice and big and um I'm trying to remember everything she said because I watched it a few days ago and I ordered it that same day. But um, all you do is you set this in here and you've got to make sure it's nice and straight when you get it in there. And she said that uh, you don't want to make them too long because apparently she's been using it a while. Um, there's no batteries or anything required for this that's what one of the great things about it um price wise this was like i said only it's 950 right now and the refills you can get at this point right now you can get um 20 for 25 dollars what happened i had it in my cart i don't know what happened to it Oh, because it sold out already because that's what happened is it was sold out and then I checked back and it was in stock so now it's sold out again where you can get a four pack for $25 so you get four refills so I don't know anyway I'll check on that later as I see if I want to um, order the refills or not and check around to see if other places have them cheaper or not all right so <clears throat> you set this in here nice and straight and you don't want it to be too long or else it won't um, do work properly. It gets crooked or whatever. So you set it in there and then you grab the tape here and you pull. And when you get to the end, which I'm not at the end yet. There it is. This pulls really easy. It was not difficult whatsoever to pull this through. And there's the end, and I don't want to waste very much paper, so I'm going to rip it off right there. So that's all there is to it. Next, it just says to rub and peel. So you're going to rub to make sure this, I guess, adheres to the sticker part. Make sure it's all the way down. All right, and then you peel off this thin layer on the top here. If I could get a hold of it. Okay, I got it, but I ripped it down. Okay, come on. Maybe this part's not so simple, huh? My nails are wrecked from pen making that I don't have long thumbnails anymore. That's what I use for everything. Come on. Of course, when I'm doing a demonstration for something, 
it would have to be difficult. There we go. I got it. All right. So, peel that off. Throw that away. It, and it's funny, and this is what part I don't understand. Uh, there is no sticky around it, and I don't know how that how that works because that's just kind of cool. Now I've got stickers though for my labels. And what she does is she uses, you know, a ruler and an X-Acto knife. And she just slices on the line. And you don't have to go down very deep. And then she also uses the X-Acto knife to peel up the label. So there's my first label right there. Oh, I didn't cut it all the way through. You tried ripping on me. I think my knife is getting dull, too. Because I use it a lot. So there we go. It is a sticker. Look at that. Put it on my container. Actually, I want to put it on the top. And there we are. That is pretty cool. So I'm just kidding this up for my next um, living room project for when um, I'm done with the one I'm doing. But I I just thought that this was the coolest thing. And my husband gave me that um, label maker for Christmas. And I was telling him about this. And I said, well, if I like this, maybe we can just send that one back. And I think that, you know, that might be what we do. Because this is really awesome. And it's simple. Because the one that my husband got me was you know, it's a, you have a computer program you use. I was, it's pretty complicated to me. I, I couldn't really figure things out. I couldn't even get the uh, thing loaded into the machine because it, it's the way it works. It was, it was really confusing and come to find out that it wasn't loading properly. And so... We just returned the whole thing and exchanged it for a new one. And I haven't even opened it because it was such a pain in the butt. It's just, it's something that takes time and I didn't really want to mess with, you know, taking time to use it. I mean, look at how little time this took. And here I've already got my labels printed out and ready to go. So, you know, this makes me happy when something is this simple. So there's all the, I separated each one of them there, and let's see, okay, that one did not rip this time. I don't know how it works, how it knew just the, the right area, but that was, that was just neat. That is so cool. You know, and I mean, I don't need the exacto knife necessarily to separate these, but separating them using the that to separate the numbers that was that's a great idea. So, um, you know, I I did subscribe to her channel. I've I've I think I've seen seen her videos suggested once in a while, but I had never watched her channel before, and. Um, I don't know. She got her. She put a link down below her video as to where to get it, and it, they wanted fifteen dollars for it. And then I thought, hmm, maybe I'll check and see if they have it on Amazon. And sure enough, they did. And I'm glad I checked because, you know, that's quite a difference in price. All right, so I'm just gonna finish uh, kidding this up and let you guys go. So I hope you enjoyed this. Um, I do have, I will have this put on my Amazon page under Diamond Painting Accessories. So the link for my, my um, Amazon page is down below in the, 
description box. All you have to do is click on that link and it takes you to my Amazon page which has different categories for different things that I've tried and that I like or things that I'd like to try. But for the most part everything on that page are things that I have purchased and I approve of and would recommend for others to get. And so this will be added to it by the time this video goes up. This will be on my list. And try it out if you're looking for something good to um, label your... E something easy, quick and easy to label your diamond paintings with. You know, this so far has... This has been uh, amazing to me. How easy this was. And I'm still kind of boggled as to how it works. But now I want to start working on this diamond painting but nope I'm gonna finish what I'm doing I've already promised that I'm going to finish what I'm started before I start a new one so guys uh, that's it for this video if uh, you like what you saw give me a thumbs up and I will see you guys in my next video which will be pretty soon and until then have fun diamond painting have fun kidding up your projects have fun doing whatever it is that brought you to this video and don't forget to always sparkle wherever you go and whatever you do take care everyone bye